So instead of simply copy pasting your YouTube or Vimeo video URL, this is a powerful option to showcase videos on your WordPress site. In this video, we are going to take a look at how we can add videos on our WordPress website. And for this, we are going to use the video player block from the plus add-ons for block editor. And with this block, you can add videos like this, where you can add a self-hosted autoplay video like this one. Or maybe you can give some unique look by adding these skew angle look to your video player like this one. And the video opens up in a pop-up. Or you can also add a Vimeo or YouTube video with a cover image and the video plays in a pop-up like this one. And same goes with the YouTube video as well. Along with that, you can showcase a full screen video with a cover image and the video plays right inside your web page. Or maybe you can create a video gallery like this one with cover images and the video plays right in the web page. So if you want to spice up your website by adding videos in a unique way, then hop in and I'll show you everything step by step. Here we are in our WordPress backend and if we go in the plugin section, we have the plus add-ons for blog editor free as well as the pro version. And to add this video player blog in your site, we only need the free version of this plugin. But if you want to take your WordPress website to the next level, then make sure you check out the pro version as well. But right now, let's go to plus settings and then go to plus blocks. And here, let's search for video. And this is the video blog that we are going to use. And as you can see, it's part of the free version of this plugin. So all we have to do is just turn on this block and then click on save. So now we are ready to add this video block anywhere on our site. Let's go to pages and maybe we want to add a video on the about page. So let's go ahead and click on edit for this one. And now in order to add these video players on your site, let me first show you an easy way. So if you visit the video player block page on the plusblocks.com, here if you scroll down and you wish to add a video like this one, where you have this skew angle for this video player. So all you have to do is just copy this template from here. So now it's copied. Let's come back here on our site. If you click on the content area and go to the top plus paste button here, let's click on this. It's going to paste the entire section on our website that we have just copied. So from here, we can simply take this block. So here we can see the list view. So this is our video player. Let's copy this. And now maybe we can get rid of everything. And now let's start by adding a container first and then add our video player. So this is how it's going to look. So let me just open this list view once again. And here if we click on this video block, here we can see on the right hand side all the settings. So right now in the layout section, the first option is content in which we can add the source of this video. So right now we have selected Vimeo. We can go ahead and choose YouTube or maybe we can add a self hosted video as well. So in case of Vimeo, we need to add the video ID. In case of YouTube, we have the video ID for YouTube as well. And for self-hosted, we just need to upload the MP4 video file here, which will get added in our media library. So if you want to save space on your website, you can use both of these options. So right now, let's keep it on Vimeo. And then we have the player settings. Let's open this. And now we can choose various settings like autoplay, mute. We can loop this video and we can also choose the video touch disable. And below this, we have an option to add the colors for the controls. So maybe we can add our custom color or maybe we can add a color from our global color palette. Below this, we have the intro title and also we have the intro portrait. And after this, we have the banner or the icon. If we click on this, here we can see the cover image. So we can update this from here. And then we have the play icon. So we can upload any image here to use it as a play icon. If you want, you can add a video title here. So it will be displayed once we do the mouse over. And then we can also add a description. 
So this goes just below the title. So if you want to add these details, you can do that from here. And then we have an option to play in pop-up, which means it's going to load the video inside a pop-up box. And then comes the most important part, SEO option. So if you really want to take advantage of adding videos on your WordPress site, then you cannot ignore the SEO options here, which is by adding a video SEO schema. So if you click on this, here we have an option to enable schema markup. Let's turn it on. So it's going to add a video schema markup on this page. After this, we have accessibility option. And here we have the iframe title. So we can give the title here as well. And then if you go to styles, here we can do the styling for everything that we see here, like the video border. So we can add a border color here, like this one. And we can also give a width to this border and a border radius like this one. So we can have these corners and we can also add a box shadow. And here is the CSS transform option. So here we need to give the CSS transformation code, which you can play around with. So instead of one degree, let's say I want to add five degrees and the skew, I don't want the 10 degrees. I just want the five degrees skew. So you can play around with this CSS code here. Below this, we have an option for icons. So we can add a continuous animation. So you can see this play icon here gets a continuous animation. So we can change the color for this as well. Or we can give the icon size. So we can change this from here. And then we have the video title. So we can change the color as well as the background from here. And then we have an option to customize the video description. And once all this is done, we can simply click on update. So this is how it looks in the front end. So we have this video player with some CSS transformation. And if we click on this play icon here, it will open up the video in a pop-up box. So that's how easily you can add a video player in your WordPress site using the video player block from the plus add-ons for blog editor. Now, if in case you want to add audio player on your WordPress website, make sure you check out this video right here where we have covered how you can create some amazing looking audio players for your WordPress website. So if you like this video, then make sure you give it a like. And to watch more WordPress videos like this, make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever we upload our next video. That's it for this one and I'll see you in the next video.